get off of Tayeba. Uh, Tayeba is a uh, 15 minutes drive from the Hassa city, the capital city of Tibet, uh, to the east. It's a place called Tayeba. Uh, that's the main place. All the masters do the uh, meditation on my thing. So, one day, Lama is all over there. There's a, a bit, a little bit harsh uh, difficulties of getting a proper resource in terms of the, uh, the food and other things. Huh? Uh, for meditators, they don't care much about the food, right? Uh, so there's uh, some, a little bit of difficulty in, in that place. Uh, the villagers are quite, uh, uh, quite poor. So when the society is quite poor, and society has no, uh, has limitation to support the meditator, right? Uh, so, then one day, Namadisha told uh, from the Tala's right, right eye, then Dambala uh, came out of Tala's right eye. You know? uh, so in the uh, so in his vision. Uh, the Tambala many Tambala came from the Tara around here. And after that, the, these villages become forest. Uh, forest. As the villages become forest, the all the meditator uh, get the basic necessity. Uh, you know? So that's a uh, that relationship, huh? Yeah. Yes. Uh, in my personal practice, I always ask for blessings or an offering for others. In other words, Buddha, the Dharma, the Sangha. I never ask for anything for myself. Okay. Now here's my question: If I ask for something for myself. Mm -hmm. Does that make my motivation and intention less pure? Okay. Am I less enlightened if mm, I ask okay. for it? So in other words, if I, I don't ask for a long life, but I will say, if sentient beings remain, then may I remain. Instead yeah. of saying, may I have long yeah, life. Yeah. And today, like the practice, I ask for wealth, but I ask for wealth so I have more resources to help others. Yeah. So if I just ask for myself, does that make my motivation impure? Uh, no. Uh, this no. You see, it the motivation uh, you. This is the uh, bodhisattva motivation. Then the bodhisattva motivation, uh, there are four different types of bodhisattva motivation. The, fir the first, uh, the motivation of bodhisattva is like a, <coughs> uh, sheep herding, like cowboy, like bodhisattva, huh? sheep herding. What you do is, you first let the all the sheep go first uh, to eat all the, uh, uh, drink all the good water and eat all the good grass, right? And the sheep herd comes later. Uh, like Buddhisita, that Buddhisita is, uh, I want to force all the beings to achieve the everlasting peace and happiness of Nirvana. After that, then I I want to be I want to realize that. First, I want to leave all of them. You understand? Uh, to experience everlasting peace and happiness in Nirvana, and then after that, then I will try to achieve for myself in this one. 
The second Buddhism is like uh, uh, captain of ship. Uh, captain of ship, you know, captain of ship. You lead the, uh, the the passengers in the ship together with you to cross the ocean from this side to the other side, right? So that the motivation Buddhism is like that. I want to achieve the everlasting peace and happiness of Nirvana. Me and all the beings together. All the beings together. Uh, this is the uh, second uh, Buddhist mind. Right? Third Buddhist mind is first I want to achieve and the everlasting peace and happiness of the liberation. So then I can be in a better position. Then I can meet all the beings uh, to experience everlasting peace and happiness of the one. You know? Mm. Then I can be. So this is this are the motivation. motivation. This is a pure motivation, pure motivation. You see. So in the Buddhist Siddha, there are two things you need to be accomplished. You focus on two things. Focus on two things. Accomplish two things. Uh, welfare of the other beings and welfare of oneself. Mm. So that if you are in a, if you experience your full potential of your consciousness, full potential of your consciousness, then you have the, uh, the means for others to realize the full potential of them. Uh, so that, You're asking something for yourself only. Uh, asking yourself what? Uh, it also depends. Asking yourself wealth, health, uh, and uh, so on. Uh, not out of duty, out of necessity. Uh, also, there are many motivations you see. If you ask something for you, you know, not out of greedy, uh, out of basic necessity. Uh, there's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong. Uh, in addition to it, you want to ask, you want to ask for yourself, then you have the, all the resources to go for to benefit more people. Pure motivation. Pure motivation. Huh? First of all, uh, we have everything now. Uh, it's just a matter of whether you want or not. Uh, and you, you have, you, you, you can, you have, you have love to share. Ah, uh, uh, you have time to share. 